Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, welcome to CBS Sports coverage of NCAA basketball. Today's game is between the Gonzaga Bulldogs and the UCLA Bruins. And we're ready to take a look at two players who undoubtedly carry a big portion of the load for their respective teams. And of course, our starting lineup. When I look at these lineups, I see two really skilled players. Keep an eye on them, Gus. They won't disappoint. Let's check out how these teams are going to set the tempo, Raph. Every game, you have to pick your areas of focus, Gus, to figure out what's going to help your team win, and you execute that. Bulldogs get possession, and away we go. Out on the left wing. And the ball is out of bounds. We'll go back the other way. The Bruins working, changing it up against the zone. And that's what makes them tough to defend. They understand how to take advantage of openings. Riley turns it over. On the left side. Shots up. Squared up on the catch. Got his puppies in order. The Bruins set up for a round one. That's tough because guys can make shots and yet they can penetrate the kick. Smith handles the feed. The junior. Going with the ball screen now. Thanks for joining CBS Sports coverage of NCAA basketball. I'm Gus Johnson alongside Bill Raftery. Way out on the right wing. Jump shot. He missed it. Cleans the glass. Campbell receives the pass. He shoots from outside. Comes up empty from deep. On the right side. Look at that block. Terrific. Nice low post play. Good entry down into the box. He thread the needle. Really did a great job at carrying the D with the back cut. Great feed and a great ability to finish in traffic. He shoots from the corner. How about that? <laughs> Smith handles the pass. Fires the freshman. In the post. Jump shot. He can't get it to go. C reacting. How alert, Gus. Now they work it around the perimeter. He swats the ball. And will head back down to the other end. This layup is definitely worth a second. Look, gotta make those, Gus. It's incredibly deflating when you don't. on the left wing. Fires. And he can't get the bounce. On the left side. Takes the medium range jump shot. Shots off. What a rebound. Jump shot. 
big time dagger. When you can pass and score like he does, it makes a coach's job a bit easier. You know, this guy can move the basketball and create his own opportunities. Really a tough guard, Gus. Campbell receives the ball. In the lane. No. And he looks to outlet. On the wing. Off the mark. Great strength. Shots off. Gets the rebound. He unloads the three. That's how to stretch the defense, Gus. If you can make those, offensively your team becomes really difficult to guard. Top of the key. How about that elevation? On the left side. Fires. Shots off. What a coach will be happy with that effort. Now they work it around the perimeter. And he lays it up and in. Both teams are looking to get something going here. On the left side. Jump shot. Shots off. Hungry for the ball. Out on the left wing. Now we've got a turtle. On the inside. He missed it. Takes the board. Got it in the low block. In the lane. He can't get it to go. He shoots from the corner. They're having a tough time hitting from the floor. On the left side. We're at the five minute mark. Shots off. Get out and fill. They work it around the perimeter. Fires. Bulldogs can't get anything to fall. I'll tell you guys, when a team is shooting the ball this poorly, they must get the ball back on defense, create some turnovers, and get some runouts. Feed the low post. And he can't get the bounce. Grabs the rebound. Jump shot. Bulldogs can't find the basket at all, coach. You know, they're really not taking advantage of their opportunities. No legs left, Gus. In the post. Fires. And another miss. They can't get anything to fall. You know, they got to find a way to get some good looks and get something going to the 10. Turns it over. They work the perimeter. Jump shot. Nice touch there to use the back. Room. You can blink and he could have 20 on him. This young man can put the biscuit in the basket. He's definitely a talent. You can relate to him uh, when it comes to putting the ball in the hoop, but he's got to be careful. You've got to remember to involve your teammates. Shots off. Out on the right wing. He tries the three. With no luck. 
there for the rebound. Call for the foul. Obviously too aggressive here defensively. You really got to know your limitations, Gus. Here we have a look at one of the sophomores for this team. He's still young, but the coach has him out there for a reason. He tends to make the right decisions out there, which means more playing time for him. A simple concept that applies to everyone, regardless of age or experience. Foul shot no good. Three minutes left on the game clock. Looking for a good shot. Fires. No. Pulls down the rebound. Turnover. They'll go the other way. In the post. In the lane. And he hits it. Two minutes left on the game clock. In the lane. Off the mark. Push it. On the right side. He fires away. Shots off. Gets the ball. In the lane. The senior. They work it around the perimeter. One minute left on the game clock. He missed it. It's important that you block out to run the offense. In the lane. The freshman. Try to pack it inside. Jump shot. He can't get it to go. Down the lane. Finger roll. So easy for this guy. Fires. And he can't get the bounce. Grabs the rebound. They work it around the perimeter. Shots off. Pulls down the rebound. Dials up a long range shot. No luck from downtown. One half is in the book. Stay tuned for CBS at the half. Let's take a look at our game summary to this point so far. You can get a sense of the story of this game by looking at some of these numbers. Still lots of time to play, though. Anything can happen. We can see here how both teams are doing with the keys they identify at the outset. They come out in a minute. minute. On the outside. He attempts the three. Up and in. 
Both teams looking to get in a, a bit of a rhythm here. He lets it go. Shots off. It's mine. On the left side. In the lane. No. Pulls it in. Now they work it around the perimeter. Jump shot. Perfect. The Bruins are controlling the pace of the game. They're doing a terrific job at playing their game. Really making a conscious effort to control the tempo and imposing their will on the opposition. Fires. Shots off. Get out and fill. They work it around the perimeter. Jump shot. Shots off. They get the offensive rebound and put back. Once again, nobody checked out. That coach is going to be beside himself. On the outside. Shots off. Rips down the board. How about that, Gus? Jump shot. How about this, kid? Huh? Tomorrow. Give me that. Out on the right wing. Fires. He missed it. Snags the offensive rebound. He shoots from the corner. And no! Jump shot. He can't get it to go. Out of bounds, and we're staying right here. This layup is definitely worth a second look. Gotta make those, guys. It's incredibly deflating when you don't. On the inside. Look at that block. Terrific reaction. Dump it inside. And it's blocked. And he can't get the bounce. Give me that. Around eight minutes remaining on the game clock. Down on the low block. Jump shot. Pushing in transition. Put a little English on it. He shoots from the corner, and hits! On the left side. And lays it in. We are at the seven-minute mark. 
turnover. He'll want that one back. They've worked the perimeter. Shots off. Snatches the board. Ah, he got it up and in. On the left side. No. Oh, physical play. Six minutes left on the game clock. Takes the pass in the paint. Can finish. On the left side. Fires. How about that, huh? Gotta love that mid-range game, Gus. The in-between game. Good scores will be able to shoot the three, score at the 10, hit that mid-range jumper. Out on the way. Jump shot. The soft move. We'll get a change of possession. Rap, it's been a great team effort for these guys. As a coach, it's great to see all five guys on the floor working together. That is impressive. That's how you win and win consistently, Gus. When multiple people contribute, it takes the pressure off your superstar. minutes left on the game clock. He attempts the trifecta. Not this time. Cool, he jams it. Cross court. He puts up the tray. But he misses his target. He shoots from the corner and misses. That's a good stop defensively. One shot and get it out. They work the perimeter. He goes for three. And he hits the three. Four minutes left on the game clock. He shoots from the corner. He gets the shot to fall. Looking for a good shot. Turnover. He'll want that one back. Well, Raph, this could go down to the wire. You've got to love these close ones, Gus. Every error is magnified. It could be the difference between a win or a loss. Gus, you've got to love these tight ones. So much on the line here. One wrong move is all it takes. There's no room for error. Seniors are important, Gus, because they bring so much to the table in terms of experience, accountability, and consistency. As a coach, you like to have guys like that on the roster who you can depend on. Got about it. The trap's in place, Rap. Smith in the post. Fires. Buries it. He fires from long range. Misses from long range. Three minutes left on the game clock. He 
looking for a good shot. He shoots from the deep corner. No! Get out and fill! Out on the right wing. of the key. And he lays it up and in. Now we've got a turtle. Out on the left wing. We are at the two-minute mark. Riley takes the pass. Jump shot. Barry. Way out on the right wing. Fires. No. Smith handles the feed. Jump shot. Off the mark. Transition. Under one minute remaining on the game clock. Can't get it to go. Smith handles the feed. This guy is a complete player in the coach. The big fella can face you up, play back to the basket. He's a good rebounder and solid on that defensive end. And we're ready. And we're back. Gus Johnson along with Bill Raftery with you here. Ready to inbound after the timeout. On the left side. He shoots from the left side of the circle. He drains the bucket. Well, Bill, it looks like they're going to spend a little time fouling right here. Uh, trying to stretch it out. And the foul will stop the clock momentarily. Sideline inbound. Foul. And that stops the clock again. They'll throw this one in from the side. And yet another stoppage, and yet another foul. And why not? Offensively, they'll set up from the sideline. And they continue to foul to stop the clock. Good strategy. Ball coming in from the sideline. Foul, and that stops the clock again. They'll throw it in from the side. And yet another stoppage, and yet another foul. And why not? Wait, wait. 
with the free throw. They can set up the press. Got it! Book it. And we're back ready to get things going again after the timeout. Dump it inside. He launches a three. And it goes. What a big time shot. And the foul will stop the clock momentarily. The young man's just a freshman, but has demonstrated that he can play at this level. This year is going to be a big year for this young guy. He'll be smart. Latch on to a few of the upper class one until he gets the hang of things. Sinks it. Rims off. Takes the rebound. Welcome back, and we're set to inbound after the timeout. Long down court pass. He throws it up from downtown. Outside, Jay won't go. It's all about shot selection, Gus. It's so important to take good shots, and not necessarily the shot the defense wants you to take. A chance for one and the bonus. Doesn't go. He shoots from long range. And before we go anywhere else, let's check in and look at our players of the game, Rap. It was great to see these two kids play well here today. These guys really competed, Gus. On behalf of the CBS Sports team, EA Sports crew, and Bill Raftery, I'm Gus Johnson. Thanks for watching.